Family Pictures USA. Once you see America through Family Pictures, you'll never see this country the same way again. Walking around the streets of Detroit, I see the city's legendary creativity on full display. What some see as trash, Detroit artist Tim Burke sees as raw materials. I asked Tim to share a photo with me to better understand his inspiration. This is a much younger Tim. And yes. who's this with you? Uh, that's my daughter, Arlie. She must have been about 10 years old, so I must have been 30. That's when I was weekend dad, divorced, and uh, seeing Arlie on the weekends. Your life has changed a lot since then, or is it pretty much as similar? Three years prior to this photo, uh, I had a crash and burn in my life. I had moved in with a family friend who was a therapist. That's when I started to address the trauma in my life from the age of seven until I was 19, being brought up in a violent, alcoholic, drug-addicted family. That family friend who was a therapist, mm -hmm. uh, he threw two rusty nails and some twine on the kitchen table and said, here, make something out of that. Ah. Yeah, and I'm like, make, make what? I didn't know what to make and did the best I could. I made a little cross that he could wear. I said, that's the best I can do. He's like, oh, that's great, that's great. He would bring stuff home and give me art projects to do. Uh, so he, this was the beginning of you becoming an artist in some ways, this, this work that you've been doing. Right. Wow. From, from that little cross uh -huh. to now this here, you know, 30 yeah. years later. You've been going around to different places in Detroit and getting materials. Yes. And turning it into art. Yes. The majority of these are from the Paquette market. It was on John R. and Paquette. Uh, it was a meat and fish market. Prior to it being the meat and fish market, it was the Studebaker Car Company that was here in Detroit. Oh. Studebaker left, that building became the Paquette market. Mm -hmm. It caught fire 10 years ago. Uh, I got a, these burnt timbers from there. Wow. So these are totemic uh, wow. symbols, right? Uh -huh. And they talk about our past here in Detroit. Wow. Of places where lots of people shopped at the uh, Paquette Market, the yeah. meat and fish market. Yeah. So, you know, yeah. history. And this is also a piece of the Lafayette Building downtown uh, Detroit. Uh-huh. Built in 1927. And a lot of preservationists tried to get them to save that building. It was a, yeah. it was a solid building. A lot of buildings that had been torn down in Detroit mm -hmm. were s savable. Uh-huh. It's Why about did, money. I it, it's cheaper to tear it down and build new yeah. than it is to try to restore yeah. the building. And as, as, as a metaphor, building or rebuilding in a sense. I know I'm not rebuilding the entire city but I'm giving it another a spin on that by using broken down material to make beautiful pieces of art with. As much as I was building my inner self with art, coming from a broken down kind of life. Through his artwork, Tim has given his life new meaning, and at the same time, he brings parts of old Detroit back to life. Want to see more videos about family photographs? Hit the subscribe button.